हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू ई क्लास माय सेल्फ स्मिता टीचर वेलकम बैक आफ्टर मेनी डेज हाउ वाज योर एग्जाम यस आई थिंक ऑल यू हैव डन नाइसली ओके स्टूडेंट्स ओपन योर मैथ्स टेक्स्ट बुक पेज नंबर 18 इन प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव स्टार्टेड चैप्टर नंबर 3 एडिशन ओके एंड फ्रॉम एक्सरसाइज फ्रॉम टेक्स्ट बुक पेज नंबर 18 वी हैव फिनिश so open your maths test book page number 19 addition with carrying over our new point is addition with carrying over now first example tanvi has 637 beads what is mean by beads beads means these are the beads okay then how many she has 637 See, in picture they have shown at 100 place 6 is there. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 100. In one sack, there are 100 beads. Okay. So, how many hundreds are there? 6. 3 tens. In this one garland, how many beads are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, one garland, one string, it shows tens then how many tens are there one two three see here at tens place three is there now these beads which are singles it shows units this bead shows units place so count the beads how many are there one two three four five six seven seven beads at unit place see here seven beads at unit place same way sanvi has five hundred 74 beads 1 2 3 4 5 at 100 place how many strings of 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 see at 10 place 7 this single bead it shows units so 4 at units place understood now uh, my question is how many beads do the two girls have all together? Last year I have told you if in world problem all together, together, in all, total. If these words have come then we have to do addition, right? So same way, what is your question? How many beads do the two girls have all together? All together means we have to add these two numbers. Okay, shall I explain it on blackboard? So, picture you have to see from the test book page number 19. Now, I will write the only numbers on blackboard. And we have to add it. Why we have to add? Because all together word has come in the question. See students, it is your example. 637 beads Tanvi has. Okay, and Sanvi has 574. It is your example. So, first step of addition is, this is vertical arrangement. But we have to arrange it. Sorry, it is a horizontal arrangement and we have to add it vertically. See, first make boxes. Here, we have to write places. Here, we have to write carrying over. This box will be big. To write both the numbers and see. This is box for answer. Okay. Now first write down places. Units. Tens. Hundred. Leave this box to write. Carrying over. Now 637. What is this? These are beads. You have to write the word. This number shows. Beads. So, this word you have to write, it is compulsory. Plus, 574. I have told you how to write the numbers. 574. See the places and put the numbers. Okay. What is this? This number also, it shows beads. You have to write here beads word. Now, solve the example. How to solve? Always start from unit place. Now 7 plus 4, 7 plus 4, if you don't know you can draw lines. For this example only I am going to explain very deeply. 
later i will count on finger otherwise orally we can give answer 7 plus 4 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 plus 4 1 2 3 4 count together these all lines you have to count together 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 how to write 11 this is the 11 okay how to write this is units this is tens right so units place answer we have to write in the units place one i have written here then what about this one in one column we have to write only one digit so this one i have written here then this one will be the carrying over to next place that is called as carrying over this one is called as carrying over okay now 1 plus 3 plus 7 you have to count 1 plus 3 4 4 plus 7 4 plus 7 again 11 how to write 11 see here this one is also called as carrying over now 6 plus 1 7 7 plus 5 count 6 plus 1 7 8 9 10 11 12 how to write 12 here? Only one box is there. So, these two I have written here. Then what about this one? Again, we have to make one column. See, this is the new column. Okay. And it is plus sign. Why I have made a, uh, this new column? Because of this one. Where to write? In carrying over. And what is the name for this place? Units, tens, hundred and TS shows. In previous lesson we have learnt it. Right. TH shows 1000. So this one here nothing will nothing is there. So this one will be as it is down. What is your answer? 1211. Okay. So uh, you have to write this answer in sentence. How to write C here? This I am going to rough. If there is one problem, that time we have to write the answer in sentence. Suppose I have asked you your name. What is your name? Simply you are saying that Arundhati. But it is wrong way to give answer. Myself Arundhati or my name is Arundhati. In this way you have to answer the question. Right. If there is one problem in maths, you have to write the answer by using these three dots. What is meant by these three dots? These three dots means therefore. Okay. These three dots shows therefore. In this example I have told you. How to write these three dots? See here. Here two dots. And in between these two dots we have to write this one. One, two, three dots means therefore. It is symbol. How this sign it shows plus. That means uh, this three dot it shows therefore therefore the two girls have 1211 bits all together okay in this way you have to write the sentence all together they have 1211 bits. Did you understand how to write the answer? If example is given in if example is given in words so you have to write the answer in full sentence. How? By using three dots. Three dots means therefore therefore all together after all together give here comma all together they have 1211 bits. Did you understand this addition by carrying over? Okay, next example we will see. Open your math test book page number 19. There is one exercise in that three examples are there, right? So one example I will explain here on the blackboard. Remaining examples you have to solve as a homework. Okay, now what is first example? 548 plus 
957 you have to add okay already they have given boxes just you have to follow the steps what is the first step always start from unit place so i have told you uh, we have to start from unit place 8 plus 7 you can draw lines 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 plus 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 Count it together. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 is the answer. We can't write 15 in this way. It is wrong way because only one digit we have to write. Which place it is? Unit. So 5 we have to write here. 1 will be the carrying over. Now add 1 plus 4 plus 5. 1 plus 4, 5. 5 plus 5, where is it? 10. This one will be the carrying over. 1, 0, 10. Now see. 1 plus 5 plus 9. 9 plus 1, 10. 10 plus 5, 15. You can draw lines also, I am telling. You can count on fingers. Okay. This one, here no digits. So this one will be as it is down. Is it world problem? No, it is not world problem. It was just a simple addition with carrying over. So no need uh, to write by using three dot that means therefore what is your answer 1505 so students so students today's homework is from textbook page number 19 you have to solve these three examples thank you have a nice day eat healthy stay healthy stay home stay safe and study well